outdoors with Ed here. I had an issue when I was setting up my Pelican Catch Power 100. Well, the first thing is this little circuit breaker came with the kayak, okay? And it came with this extra wire. Obviously, I am smart enough to figure out that red goes with red and black goes with black. Uh, but here's, here's where the issue is. So there was a wire that came for the positive. Okay, got that. But there was no wire that came with the circuit breaker go to the negative. Now, the negative pre-wired harness obviously goes with the negative on the battery to power the trolling motor. I got that. But what I'm concerned is, and I've already had this hooked up, and it already I already know that it works. So I've hooked the red, the positive on the positive, and I've, I've hooked the negative on the negative, and it works. But my concern is, is that leaves this little plug empty. Now my question is, is that a concern? Do I need to go purchase another wire so that I'm running the circuit breaker um, to the battery? And connecting this wire to the circuit breaker and then another wire to the battery if that makes sense please offer your suggestions all right the second issue is back here where the connection is to hook your trolling motor um, up. now I have it successfully hooked up but what I want to show you is is this is the connector that I had on my existing trolling motor I had Purchased this when I first got my Bass Raider, and it worked perfectly in the Bass, Bass Raider. Now, that is a universal plug, as those things go. At least I think they are. Now, it was working fine, no issues, but this plug would not plug into that connector. Now, uh, I'm going to pull this one out. As you can see, it's the same plug very same plug but for some reason the one in my right the one in my right hand would not fit into that adapter so i had to take it off of my trolling motor no harm and then installed this one and i did so but this and this one um it fits in there perfectly but there is no change there is no difference in the plugs See, it's in. There's no difference in those two plugs. If anything at all, this, this uh, top prong is maybe a hair, just a hair higher, sitting higher than the other one. But I didn't think that would cause a big difference. But at any rate, I didn't want to damage my receptacle. So I went ahead, took it off, and put, um, put the uh, connector that came with the boat. See, this one came with the boat went ahead and installed it and it works fine it just uh, I just wanted to make this video just to make you aware that if you have the same issue when you get your catch power 100 they just know that you aren't alone but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna keep this one because I know that it works on my Bass Raider so uh, probably gonna get another trolling motor for the Bass Raider and then I'll know that this plug works other than that I just wanted to share with you. I still haven't had a chance to get it out on the water yet. Um, but I am pleased with it. And I'm looking forward to getting it on the water. Can't wait. I'm, uh, I'm, I'm as happy as a kid in a candy store. And this is exciting stuff. Um, I did um, an unwrapping video, and but I think I missed a few things. One of the one of the neat things about this is it actually has um, a hook there for if you have a trailer, you can pull it up on your trailer and attach it. That is a neat uh, thing for this kayak, but I do not have a trailer at this time. But I wanted to just uh, go over that with you. This seat. I didn't realize it at first, but this seat actually comes all the way out if you need to. That would have made it easier installing the base to the seat, but at the time I didn't 
I didn't realize that, so, um, but if you need to, this slides all the way out, and um, for whatever reason, if you need to, for whatever reason, but uh, I can't see myself needing to take it out. But I have it set up, and now all I'm waiting for is an opportunity to get it on the water. Thanks for watching, I appreciate it. Uh, please add your comments in the uh, comment section. Let me know your experiences with your Catch Power 100. And if this has been helpful, please like the video and subscribe to the channel. I will be adding more outdoors adventures in the future. Thanks for watching.